Augusta Aviation has been well known for its ability to maintain and operate Navajo Chieftains. And November 62899 has been based and maintained by us for many, many years. November 62899 has 7939 total time. It has 383 hours since factory overhaul on the right engine and 1729 on the left engine. It has complete logs in excellent order and the annual is due in March. This aircraft has full de-ice with heated windshield, prop de-ice, and boots that are in excellent condition. And it also has a VG kit. This aircraft is painted Matterhorn white with burgundy and gray stripes. It has no corrosion. It was painted in 2003 and it is rated a strong eight. This interior was new in 2003. It has eight seat executive configuration with gray and maroon leather seats. It has tables, potty, and a refreshment center. It also has air conditioning, oxygen, tinted windows, and a cargo door. We rate this a strong eight. Hey, Lisa, how you doing? Hey, Lynn, how are you doing? I'm doing great. This sure is a pretty cheap one, isn't it? It sure is a beautiful one. Well, I can't wait to show you the avionics. Well, let's get going. All right. Hi, welcome to the cockpit of 62899. I'd like to take a moment to show you some of the avionics features this aircraft has to offer. At the top of our center panel, we've got our GNS 530 Garmin unit. Below that, we've got a King audio panel. And for your standby common nav, we've got a King KX175 Bravo. In the center of the panel, we've got a graphic engine monitor by Insight. It's a GAMI 1200 unit, which is a great way to display your TITs, your EGTs and your cylinder head temperatures. At the center of the panel we've got a FlightMax EX500 unit which also has a color weather radar in it. And at the bottom of the panel we've got a King transponder. On the far right side of the center panel we've got our InSight Strike Finder. At the top left of our pilot's panel we've got a digital AstroTech clock. Below this we've got our David Clark intercom system. This is a six place intercom system with a stereo input. We've got our fuel computer. In the center of the panel we've got our HSI and below that we've got our backup OBS. And then on the far right side of the panel we've got our digital DME for both NAV1 and NAV2. This aircraft is equipped with electric trim on the yoke, of course your push to talk button and your autopilot disconnect button. On your center console, we have an automatic 5 autopilot, which works very nicely. On the co-pilot's panel, you've got a full array of co-pilot instrumentation, as well as all of the engine gauges. Now that you've had a chance to see the panel, let's take her for a flight. I'll see you in the air. <laughs> 